Hi, welcome back to LGS Microscopes. My name is Paul, and today we're going to briefly go over the difference between plan and DIN objectives. So for our comparison, we're just going to look at this slide of an earthworm cross-section. For this example, we're just going to use 40x magnification. This is a plan objective. And you can see how it's in focus from the center all the way to the edge. And when we use these DIN objectives, on the same magnification, this is the same slide, you might notice that the center of it is in focus, but the outer edges are not. So if I move the fine focus, you can kind of see it focus from the outside to the inside. If you're wondering how you can tell the difference between plan and DIN objectives, it's really quite simple. On the objective itself, it'll say plan, or sometimes it'll say P, or for semi-plan, which is in between DIN and plan objectives, it'll say SP or semi-plan. This is a DIN objective. It won't always say DIN or D-I-N on it, but you'll notice that nowhere on the objective does it say plan or P or semi-plan or SP. Typically, these are not marked, or they'll say acromat, but if it's a plan objective, it'll say plan. Now this might not make a huge difference to you. For some people it drives you crazy. Other people you really don't mind. It's really a matter of preference, but now you know the difference. And if you ever have any questions, of course, you can always email us at info at lgsmicroscopes.com or you can call us at 623-240-2232. I hope this has been helpful. Thanks and have a great day.